Hello everybody, my name is Thalion, and welcome back to Alien Isolation. Last time we were here, we were in this interesting... I don't remember how to do anything. We were in this interesting situation where we got rid of all of our guns. So now we're going down into the Apollo core. We want to meet Apollo. Uh, let me see. Do I have anything on the map? Um, so I don't know what's going up right now. Like, we gotta just go around and grab stuff. Apollo information sheet. Wide Apollo system for your deep space orbital station. Self-regulation and android maintenance. Security through removal of synthetic self-determination. Instant communication. No interference. Lightning fast data movement across the station. Reliable, efficient, self-sustaining. A true season product. But, okay, nothing else I can do there. So now I guess we're gonna go talk to Apollo and try to get him to stop freaking the hell out. Like, seriously, Apollo needs to just calm down. He is just, uh, he, she, it. It is just going crazy. Um, I don't know where, where am I supposed to be going? I didn't even check my objective. Oh, just down the hall. Just down the hall. Easy enough. Why was it okay with me bringing in, like, gas and ion torches, but not okay with me bringing in, uh my guns and my flamethrower. Like, you'd think you would have also picked up on that. I'm just gonna run around over here at the speed of sound. Oh. Okay. Ooh! Audio log. Great. It's cheap. There's something wrong with your synthetics. Well, yeah, we figured that out. Uh, what in the world? They oh. About a hazard containment order. Yeah. Tried to get into my control booth and then just marched off. I know I always complain about this. <laughs> Ricardo, the conduits off Oh, no. Now I've got to go to the I've got a meeting with your boss, Betty. The turbine's the running hot, Ricardo. So Full speed. Around. Oh, man. That audio overlay was really annoying. Um, wait. Isn't. Wait, am I mistaken? Oh, I have to go to the other hallway now. Okay. But I'm very interested because the Xenomorph's not coming back. I actually talked to somebody, and I didn't mean to spoil that for myself, but it's just, there's no way it can. Like, there's no reasonable way it can. It's just, it's in a gas giant. Nothing survives a gas giant. Name me one thing that survives a gas giant. Come on. One thing. Just one. Oh, that's a terminal. So, now we're dealing with the main meat of the story story. It's weird that the motion tracker was freaking out. Um, do I need to do a security access tuner on this? Yep. Alrighty then. So, we are home free now. We just gotta deal with Apollo and then maybe take the Anissa door off and we're, we're blasting off at the speed of... Turbine's off. Way should be clear. Uh, let's see. Okay. Wait, where am I going? No, I don't want to open Steam. No, that's not what I intended to do, <laughs> my bad. Okay, okay, so yeah, going for that door. Come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Super fast, super fast, super fast, super fast. Where do I go, where do I go, where do I go, where do I go? Okay, up, 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 oh, up, 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 up. Don't get torn to shreds. Don't get torn to shreds. Oh. She said something about a turbine. Okay. Here we go. I need to find Apollo. Access it. Okay, let's get down. Uh, crouch. This is gonna be tight. That. Good luck. It's not that tight. Woof! Okay. No! No, Ricardo! Great. Just keep him cross for me, huh? There's gonna be lots of germs down there, Rip. Could be dangerous. No! But so Ricardo's my only help! So I could get here. I've gotta try. No. I thought he was a pretty nice guy for a synthetic. He really was. Me too. Oh. Hi! Okay, so there's the Apollo core, there's the right hemisphere, we got a save point here. So we are officially, I think, at the point of no return for the going back to Ricardo safety. Um, I don't think we're at a literal point of no return for the game, but... Oh, he's still got- oh, oh god, oh god, poison gas. Nice, nice Ricardo. Ricardo? Oh man. For sake. I 
if you can hear me, find another way to make content. Something's Whoa. Like oh. Human. Whoa, is that a working Joe up there in a hazmat? Well, that's weird. Okay. I'll just uh, learn to deal with that. Gas mask. Oh, yes. Gas mask collected. Sweet. I'm good now. Do I have to equip it or. Well, probably not. Um. Uh, Apollo would like to ask for your patience during the current hazard containment alert, which is currently at level Omega. Thank you. Thanks, buddy. Uh. Stunning. Something crazy just happened. Sebastopol is off the market. What? A weeks before they start taking the place oh. apart and they u turned. After all those endless presentations and tours, I guess the talks weren't stalled at all. Really? Some of the company headquarters just had to. Click his fingers. A message of confirmation just came in. Apollo is currently receiving a packet of new operation rule sets. So, I guess... Oh, you're working, Joe. Now, this is board level need to know stuff until it's announced to shareholders. That's weird. Promotion, huh? But it couldn't have worked out because, I mean, they were still scheduled for decommission. Which leads to this situation that we're in right here. Or maybe, oh, maybe it was purchased and then decommissioned and they were going to use it for scraps. Or maybe they wanted the Xenomorph egg. Mm, hi, buddy. I'm going to go around. Oh, God. Which way do I need to go? Okay, through here. Okay, come on. I'm going to get some distance. And then I'm going to hide. Oh, God, there's a save point. Uh, do I risk it? Yeah, I risk it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on! It's probably the, one of the riskiest saves I've done. Come on, come on. Okay, now we go. Now we go. Now we go. Oh, bad day. Bad day. No, no, okay. I'm gonna push you away and I'm gonna run. Okay, run. Run, 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 run. Open up, open up, open up, open up. Open. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Which way do I go? Which way do I go? Wait, did I just make a loop? Oh, crap. That's my way. That's my way. Okay, get down, get down. Crouch. Get under the table. There is no such thing as under the table. I have no stun baton ammo. Okay, but I can sneak back around this way. I can't. Oh, balls. Bye. What? What? Why did that work? Why did that work? No, no, wait, you keep, I thought I could stun lock you. Crap, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, oh, no, oh, no. Oh, that was crap. I thought the MPU, oh, does it, the suit, the suit probably takes care of them. Crap. Oh, ID badge. Okay. There's a guy coming for me there, and then there's an android here, if I remember right. But wait, he's not here anymore. Oh, okay, there he is. Oh! Please don't come in here. Okay, wait, so where I need to be is in here. I don't even need to go over there. Oh, there's a security. There's a computer I need to hack over here. I thought that guy was gonna follow me into this room, but looks like it all worked out for the best. Ow, he hit my eye when I got mad at dying. Okay, come on. Um, okay, let's see. What in the world? Oh, that one always confuses me. Okay, um, there we go. We're good. Okay, and left hemisphere server banks now active. Please don't make left noises. Server banks now active. Thanks for making noises. Okay, so we gotta go find bank consoles. I would love to have saved, but I still am on cooldown. Okay, so left and right. Okay, easy enough. We swing around left, then we go for the right, and we're good. We're good. I have no stun batons, but it wouldn't work anyway because they have hazmat suits. So I actually have to go back to being stealthy. Okay, sneak around this way. This way. Did I already grab this audio log? <gasps> this is the guy that did the lockdown with all the weapons. There are conflicts with the hazard containment breach. Synthetic safety procedures are getting bypassed left and right. Cons are offline. I thought it was random, but I'm not so sure. Oh my god. Okay, that's really cool. So there was somebody else that tried to talk to Apollo. I can't remember his name. I do remember he was like, I guess, Suzanne's fiance or husband or 
something. Okay, just safety protocols. Okay, calmly. And quietly. Oh fucking okay. balls. If I power these up, one of them should give me access to Apollo security banks. Okay. Well, I don't have time. Okay. <laughs> Running around. Oh god, no, no, no. Bad, 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 bad. Oh gosh, that was terribly. Oh god, they're everywhere. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. Okay. So, go through there. Go through here. Go, go through here. Find a hiding spot. Find a hiding spot. Find a hiding spot. <gasps> okay. They're not gonna find me. Where did I go? Okay, I'm just right outside the door. So, I'm gonna wait until they sneak off, and then I'm going to go back in, and we're gonna be good. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be golden. Are they coming for me? <gasps> Hello. Oh, you were already in here? We're good. Waste company time. Okay. They're both right out there. Okay. And then one went over there. I don't know if he went out a different exit. I don't know if there is a different exit out of this room. Oh man, this is bad. They're everywhere. I have no guns. I have no anything. I have a mol. I have a Molotov. I wonder if that will work. Oh god, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to look at my inventory, not. Oh crap. Time to find out how this works. Does that work? I killed myself. Oops. Quietly, calmly. There's the android right there. Whoa. Okay. It's gonna be really difficult to do this. Because, well, wait, what if he goes, cuts into the room? If he cuts into the room, I don't want to. Yep, exactly. Okay, so he's over there. Come on. Just gotta sneak around. So when he goes into that room, I'm gonna wait a few ticks and then. Then I'm going to enter. Because. Well, it's actually fairly clear. Okay, I can sneak around this side. Okay. Just don't turn around. If I power these up, one of them should give me access to Apollo security banks. Yeah, so... Okay, that's powered. Okay, that should... Ooh, that was close. There's, there's an android over... How do I... Oh, God. Oh good, I thought the flashbang would take care of you. Oh no, not against the wall. No, okay. Oh, I thought the flashbang would distract you for much longer than that. Okay, to the side, to the side. Okay, where am I going? Oh god, why do I always get into this mess? Oh wait, I'm good, I'm good. Oh, I could have gone down the right side, I didn't have to do both. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Don't run, don't run, it says. Don't run, it says. Oh, balls. This is the exact same place I died before. Oh, good. Oh! That's actually really good information. That means I can't kill you. Come on. Come on. I just need a hidey hole. Terrible hidey hole. Please don't. Please don't tell me you don't know where I am. Please tell me you don't know where I am. That was really obvious where I went to go hide, though, so. Oh! Oh! You're different! You're new. Please, I don't want to do this again. I don't want to do this again. I'm dead. Oh god, so many androids. So many androids. Dang it. Wait, how did I die there? Did the android just like tap me on the back? Like I don't like I had the gas mask on. Maybe it, like I breathed in. Oh my god, I have to do this again. 
Okay, I got a plan. You got a plan? Noisemaker to the far end of the room. So they should loop back around. Go. Go check it out. Okay. Okay. If I power this up, one of them should give me access. Yeah, we should be fine. Events. Which one is it? It's the middle one, right? There. We're good. Now, can I take this? Yes, and I can climb through here, so we're good. We're good. That was much easier. That was much easier. Low power. And open. Boom. And there's a save point. That was so much easier with the noise maker. Just a quick distraction. I forgot how long these things last. Hey, Mr. Android. So I just gotta be extra sneaky. So I'm gonna save, and we're gonna be good. We're gonna be golden. I'm gonna go to the Apollo Core, and we're gonna have a good time. We're gonna have a good time. So let's see. Now what do I need to do? Uh, use this as a security access tuner on the dome. Okay, so right here. Boom. Alrighty. This looks like kind of an old and broken terminal. Wait. Oh, gosh. What? Oh, uh, okay. Find a way to reduce security capabilities. Oh, no. Okay, good. It's so, okay. It's just oh, stuff over here. So I'm gonna t I'm gonna turn off more power. Is that what's going to happen? What did that do? Okay. Oh, maybe that feeds extra power into the memory banks right here, which allows me to hack into this. Mat press matching move keys when circuit is active. I don't know what I'm doing right now. Oh, I get it. I'm dumb. Okay, I know what's going on. I didn't see the stuff on the left that says, like, it's like a rhythm type thing. I didn't see that before. That was my bad. That was dumb. So now I need to go do it on the other side as well. The side that I came in. Apparently I may have lied. Because when I went over there, that terminal and that other vent, the one that I originally came in, was not active. So I may have that may have been enough with the one to reduce the security capabilities. So we'll go see. Hopefully that's the case and I can go ahead and do my hacky thing into Apollo. And if I remember right, it was somewhere up here. Oh, did it change it? Where it was? There we go. And we are golden. We are hacking into a, an extremely sophisticated AI. So we're good. All right, what we got? Consult with Apollo. Oh, yeah. This is going to be so cool. We get to talk with the like, mastermind AI. It's going to be so cool. Um, am, I, am I doing this right? Oh, okay, yeah, it's all turned on. It's all turning on. Is it gonna be like a god voice at me? Like, oh, I am Apollo. God of the sun. Oh, apparently Apollo lives. Uh, oh! I like literally go in and chat with Apollo. Cutscene time! Oh man, this is a. Uh... This reminds me of the Talos Principle, where you talk to the AI on the computers. Oh, okay. Luke, turn off your targeting computer. Apollo Core startup, reset prior, whatever. Set resolution to 1980 by 1020. Negative to special order the hell? in progress. Wayland yutani Question mark? Wayland yutani owned this facility. Purchase orders received. Okay, so yeah, Wayland. Me. So Weyland Wutani bought it. What is special order 939? Priority one, protect specimen. I was right. They, they bought it for the xenomorph. They bought it so that they could have access to the xenomorph. Hey, you better be mad. On the damn station. Oh, that's a good reason. That's a good reasoning. It's no longer there. What? Negative? Fuck. Scheduled reactor scans are unverified. So, yeah. So... 
that was a really quick exchange with Apollo. But basically, Wayland Utani, right after they left, was like, oh, there's a xenomorph on board. We want that specimen. So they bought the space station out of nowhere. They were going to have it trapped on there, and then they were probably going to capture it to study it. So that was the reasoning. Um, okay. Escape Apollo beneath core. How do I do that? How do I do that? Where do I go from here? But yeah, so that's the story for why Apollo is acting up. Wayland Utani is making Wayland it do so. Utani, Which is funny because everything on Apollo is uh, Seekson. Like, or everything on Sevastopol is Seekson, including Apollo itself. So we, this really does come down to like a big business deal um, where Wayland Utani is trying to capitalize on a business asset, which doesn't surprise me. I was kind of hoping for, for an AI gone rogue type story, but this works just as much because it's talking about big business and it's very interesting. Apollo primary interaction log. Class human interaction. Request for intercorporate messaging received. Outgoing message to Wayland Utani. Uh, let's see. Oh, no, I meant to actually look more, more in depth at that. Let's see. Anything else? So this is talking about the purchase order. Uh, page up, page down. I don't have a page up, page down. Oh, yeah, I do. Okay. There we go. Um, and, uh, unidentified... Okay, this is what I was talking about, reactor systems. Um, and I... Unverified scans of reactor systems. The special order has been initiated. Protect the specimen, making station quarantine. So now I have to, like, re-verify the scans. Um, they... Okay, so they... What is Taylor? Taylor has level 4 access right there that you see because she's a, um... Uh, executive rep. Um, expendable. Well, screw you, too. Okay, keep things quiet. Spedding its ransom. With the Wayland yutani buyout, it's more important than ever that the flight recorder handover goes without a hitch. There'll be low-level uh, execs and won't know jack about the buyout, but if they hear rumors about a disappearing people problem, well, I don't want to rock the boat, and neither do you. Let's just keep everything nice and quiet. We don't want them having second thoughts. Oh, so wait, were they buying... Was it Were Wayland yutani just buying the flight recorder? No, they bought all the specimens. They had to have been buying it for the specimen. Because, yeah, it confirmed that when Amanda was talking to Apollo. Um, back. Anything else for me? Nope. Just more exposition. Excellent. All right. So, here we go. We're going to engineering. <gasps> We're going to engineering. I remember at the very beginning of this entire series, I went to engineering because I heard so I thought I heard something about their da somebody's daughter being in engineering. I thought it might be like a side quest. And I just died immediately. The, the xenomorph just wrecked my face. It was my first time dying to the xenomorph. You on comms, Ricardo? Hey, Ricardo! Apollo's running Wayland Utani protocols. Yeah, they did. Utani are in control of Apollo. It's refusing to lift the lockdown. It says there's something up with the reactor. I have a feeling. Sorry, Ricardo, but I'm small fry. Me, Samuels, Taylor, we all are. Guess if we amounted to anything, Apollo wouldn't be so ready to see us killed. That's very true. Because it did label us all as expendable, what? Um, so I have to go into a reactor now, which usually ends well. Reactors usually don't explode when you mess with them too much. Never. That's never happened in a video game or movie or real life. I'm just going to power up literally everything that I get. Oh, I thought that was alien goopy goop for a second there. Activate the tram. Okay. So we're going to just push on to sundown. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Hurry up. Come on. Just now punch that button. Uh, ooh. They are. Uh, oh wow, that's really a weird look. No oh, man. So this is. Oh okay. 
I'll report the incident to Waits and the Marshals. So okay, so yeah, so this is it's, it's really cool how the um the audio logs jump back and forth between the timelines. With like you get some that are like when the xenomorph is here and everybody's terrified of it. And you get some where they're trying to find out why people are missing or what the synthetics are going wrong. And it's just really cool to see them at different parts in the realization of the narrative. But that's all the time I have for today's episode. So thank you everybody for watching. This has been Alien Isolation. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Thalion out. See ya. But I later- Oh no, I didn't even go into a boss room yet! Ah, oh, Larry Jr. Okay, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I forgot that that was a boss room. Oh god, I'm bad, I'm bad. Oh, you got me.